The Border Patrol says one reason for those numbers going down might be because fewer people are crossing into Arizona from Mexico illegally. And one reason for that might be better fencing. A few months ago, the Border Patrol rebuilt the fence near the border crossing in Nogales, and now they're putting up new fencing in the city of Douglas. Reporter Lydia Camarillo has just returned from Douglas, where crews are working on the project. Lydia? That's right. We spoke with both Border Patrol officials as well as residents in Douglas about the impact this new fencing will have on their lives. To see customers like these from across the border inside the runaway store in Douglas is rare. Yeah, it's affecting our business big time. Store owner Mark Beal says having his business by the Mexico border has been tough lately. Those are the anti-immigration laws that are coming in. People are scared. They don't want to cross anymore. And now a new barrier. Construction is underway to update the old border fence. They're taking down about six miles of the old one and replacing it with a significantly taller one. This new fence is also designed to allow border agents see through it better. So we're going to be able to respond a lot faster and mitigate that threat a lot quicker. So there's going to be less traffic coming through the community of Douglas. According to Border Patrol, they have seen a decrease in activity along border cities and Douglas is no exception. Now I can't say that the fencing alone is responsible. We've also added additional agents and we've deployed better technology to that area as well. But residents are not convinced that this taller fence will keep people on the Mexican side of the border. You know, people that uh, are really in need, they, they're going to do what they can to feed their families and to get, you know, to get by in life. If they have to jump a higher fence, then it's just going to be more injuries. As for the people in Douglas, store owner Mark Beal agrees that he feels safe and has not seen the dangers many think are at the border. I've never had any problems. I've never been broken into and the border's right behind me. Border Patrol tells me the fence cost around $14 million and is set to be finished in March 2012. Live in Phoenix, Lydia Camarillo, Cronkite News.